Hey Verlin and Gary, this is Shami with Southtown Chrysler. Just wanted to do a quick little walk around video for you. Uh, this is just on the 2021 GT Durango uh, all wheel drive. Now obviously it might not be the exact same color, but at the end of the day it's a uh, really nice gray metallic. At least it'll be nice to kind of go through the features with you. So this one is very, very fully loaded. You do have the front fog lights in the front there. Uh, you do have the upgraded rims. Now this one also has the side indicators. They are heated as well. I don't know if you could see that. Just in the corner there. But this one does uh, come with push button ignition. So it does have the smart access. You never need to take your key out of your pocket. Now, if you look at the, uh, the rear end over here, you'll notice you do have your tow package, your dual exhaust. You do also have the rear parking sensors. And this also has the rear tailgate, so the rear power tailgate. Now, when it comes to space in the back, I know you're gonna be using these uh, third rows very kind of seldom, but if you do use them, you definitely have a lot of space in here with them down and with them up as well. Um, there's your power uh, tailgate button, but in the back here, nice and open, obviously tons of space. It is nice to see that you got some vents over here with your tri-zone climate to make sure that everyone's kind of comfortable. close the tailgate really quick okay so when it comes to the interior obviously it is a brand new vehicle very very nice on the inside very wide lots of space and that front end looks very very nice uh, in the cockpit there but now you'll see in the back you do have a couple USB smart chargers you have a uh, couple heated seats in the back here and you also have a nice 150 watt plug-in so that's a really nice touch if you got any iPads or you know any young ones in the vehicle as well. Uh, keep all your electronic devices nice and charged. Now, you do have power seats on both sides, which includes this passenger side here. But you'll notice that when it comes to the actual lumbar, on this one, uh, on the passenger, it is a manual. Yeah, super nice front end. These new Durangos look super, super sharp. Okay, let me pop in the front here. Now, you will notice you have two position when it comes to your memory seating. There's your power seats for the driver. And again, really nice inviting cockpit. Now, let me hop inside here. You'll see we have a nice digital gauge cluster with that LCD screen in the back there. Uh, 51 kilometers, this is a brand new vehicle after all. Now you'll notice your Bluetooth, your hands-free and all your kind of cruise control options are just gonna be on the steering wheel. You do have a couple paddle shifters as well, which is super cool. You have a automatic start-stop mode. So when you're at a traffic light, it'll actually uh, kill the engine uh, just to kind of help you save some more fuel. But it also will uh, keep all your other systems on like the AC and the electronics. So don't worry on that end. Um, you have a sport mode, an eco mode, and you also have your uh, selectable parking sensors that you can turn off. Heated seats in the front, heated steering wheel, nice big screen. And this is Dodge's new uh, infotainment screen. So it's like almost just like using your iPad. It's super, super easy to do. Um, and the quality is really, really crisp. Now, let me pop this in reverse really quick. You can get a look at the backup camera. Now, if I do turn my steering wheel, Gary, in Berlin, you'll notice that the actual lines do change. So that does mean that this one has adaptive uh, rear view camera. And that center line over there is really nice if you're kind of lining up your, uh, uh, your trailer and you want to make sure you're kind of, uh, when you're going to hitch up, uh, that you kind of get right on the, the nose there. Now, this one as well, if you notice, it does have, here, let me try to zoom in properly here. It does have your SOS, it does have your power dimming, uh, and obviously your assist. You will notice that this one doesn't have any sunroof, but you know what, you do have lots of leather. Like, you have leather kind of all over the dash here, looks really, really nice. And underneath, you do also have your trailer brake control, your very cool push button ignition right there. But overall, you know what, just a super, super nice package. Now, I'm sure you guys do listen to, uh, to a fair bit of music. Let's see what we can do, because I know this is going to have a really, really nice sound system. OK, 
kill, let's see. Oh, and obviously there's a commercial. All right. Well, and there's so many different apps you can kind of play around with on this thing. It's so cool. But yeah, at the end of the day, here, let me see. Let's put on maybe some hip hop or something, eh? No, too light. Come on. So if it was up to me, I would be listening to, uh, that'll work. For those who envy me saying I ain't about nothing, but everything you see my name's on something, yeah. Okay, the sound system, take my word for it. I think I might have woke up some of the uh, the technicians in there. Well, it is the morning, right? So they should get up. Um, but yeah, really, really nice sound system. You can play around with this navigation screen all day long. So many different options in it. But here, let me just give you this final little look at the front. So here's the vehicle, guys. I mean, I'm gonna be giving you a call at about 12 o'clock here on your lunch break, Gary. But at the end of the day, it's kind of nice to know that you have something to refer to. Um, and obviously dealing over the phone, you wanna make sure that, uh, you know, this person on the other end of the line's not kind of pulling your chain and, and make sure that uh, if he says he's gonna show you a GT, he's gonna show you a GT. But you can reach me at my cell phone, my friend, 780-932-7597. Cell Chrysler. Thanks so much, talk to you soon, bye.